Hello everybody, what is up, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Hollow Knight. In the last episode, I actually was trying to make it a shorter video, but made it a little bit longer because I uh, listened to the 57 percepts of Zoat. I actually had to extend the video a little bit to do it. It's... Oh man. Oh wait, what am I doing? I came up here to buy stuff, and then I got distracted by Zoe, and then I totally forgot to buy stuff. Oh my gosh. Um, let's see. I can finally afford this, the simple key. I'm gonna want to get that. Oh, whoops. Why did I say no? Hit yes. Alright. And now I got that one, and boom. No, 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 I don't want that. That's useless. Okay, so now, if I want, I can also go and buy some more charm notches um, from down in the Forgotten Crossroads where Salubra's at. I could get that. Um, I also am going to have to eventually go back to where Leg Eater is at. That's also right near where a Dreamer is. Uh, but I was wanting to... No, no, no. I need to go back to the palace grounds. I need to go back down to the palace grounds and down to the ancient basin. That's right. Man, I'm just getting distracted. There's too many things to do. Alright, so... Hold on. There is some more things I can buy, actually, here. Just a few more things left I could buy. Ah, <sighs> I could buy this. And that's really all that I need to buy. Yeah, that's all I really need to buy. No, I didn't mean to talk to you again. Alright, let's go back down into the Ancient Basin and let's go and get our Shadow Dash ability. Hopefully I can do this quickly. Oh, you're already here. I don't know why I did that. Sorry. Let's go back to the Hidden Station. Oh, that's right. I never talked to you here. Let me, let me talk to him. Ah, uh, what station is this? Hidden all the way at the bottom of the world. Until I heard the bell calling. I didn't even know the stagways traveled so deep. You discovered something quite astounding, little one. No matter how old I grow, the world still keeps surprising. Surprises like this stowed away. That's cool. Alright, let's... Do our crystal dash. I can't do anything about that yet. I actually need quite a bit of essence of the dream essence to be able to do that. How much dream essence am I up to, by the way? 225. Okay. But from here, we're going to go down. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to bump the mic. Die. Yes. Die and give me your money, your geo. I'm going to need it. Alright, higher beings, these words are for you alone. Our pure vessel has ascended. Beyond lies only the refuse and re regret of its creation. We shall enter that place no longer. Yep. I am actually going into a kind of dangerous, uh, area. I mean, obviously, this is like, this really is the abyss, man. Hmm. We definitely want to fall down, all, like, almost all the way. There is some other stuff in this area. Like, right here, there's Geo. <laughs> that was a lot of Geo flying around me that couldn't get to me. I thought there was... I think there's something all the way down to the left, too. Oh, I made it. I made it down here. And down here, we'll also start to encounter another kind of new enemy. Oh, man, a name was starting to pop up, and I just went away. Am I supposed to go this way first? No, no, no. I don't think so. Ow. But is there a bench over this way? Or is there a boss? 
I can't remember. Wait. Oh! Wait a minute. Isn't this where you get the Howling Wraiths? What's going on here? Whoops, why did I do that? I don't know why I did that. That's weird. I could have sworn I was supposed to be able to get the, uh, the Shriek or whatever. The sh or maybe it, that's the upgrade to it. I think that might be what the upgrade to it is. Okay, so here we have new enemies. Like I said, and these are called siblings. Why are they called siblings? Because they're literally like your character's um, shadow, or your shade, I mean. And the reason for this is because, uh, remember how I said your character was essentially like a failed experiment, kind of? Well, your siblings are also, well, these, these siblings are literally also the other failed experiments. Now, this part here, you want to be really careful on, and you kind of want to take it a little bit slow. Because it's very easy to get overwhelmed here, and ow, man. No. Oh, God, there's so many of them. Did you see how many there were? Ah, uh, and the worst part is there's no healing here. So, right now, this is kind of a bad situation. Because I just caused a whole ton of them to spawn in. Aha. Uh -huh. Speedrunning tactics. Not really. I don't like these guys. There's too many of them, and they're gonna kill me. God. Oh. Okay. So you gotta get up here. Oh, man. <sighs> That was close. But thankfully, now that we've gotten up here, we can hit the switch and this. Lights the lighthouse. Now, the siblings are gone. We don't have to worry about them anymore. And over here, if we had come over here, I should have probably shown it, but if we had come over here, there would have been a bunch of those, like, black claw things that stretch up out of the shadow, out of this, like, black liquid here. And we basically wouldn't have been able to do this to get across. Um, yeah. So we had to climb up and light that tower. That's, like, the that was the hardest part. But after... Afterwards, now we're now we're basically good. Huh. I don't know if I'm going the right way or not though. No, I'm not. Okay. I think it all leads to basically the same. Yeah. Here we go. So now we gotta dip ourselves into this. Uh Oh, we've been filled with the shadow. Absorb the shade cloak. To dash forwards cloaked in shadow. Use the cloak to dash through enemies and their attacks without taking damage. Yes! Huh, can I dream now? Oh, this thing has like a dream shield as well. Oh, whoops. Oh yeah, that's right. This teaches you to use it. So... Boom, can dash through that and got an arcane egg. And now we can also go through those um, 
phone don't die on me. Now we can go through these shadow things we couldn't get through before. Uh, it does take a few seconds though, as you can see, for your shadow dash to like re, like form, but an imprint of abyss given form. Oh, that entered into my hunter's journal. I don't know if I ever got that for my hunter's journal on my far profile. I might have to do that. I'm about to come back here and do that. Oh. I can't go through here? Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't think I ever came here on my far profile. I know I got the uh, sh shake cloak down here, but I'm definitely gonna have to make sure to come back. All right, let's get out of here. And it does make a sound every time it like re-ups, it's like, there, there you go. That's a good example. And, uh oh, that's right. Unfortunately, these shadow things will still be writhing. So they're not in the light of the, uh, lighthouse. No? Ah! Now I wonder if I can... Now I wonder if I can go back to the left again, or do I st no, no, I don't think I can. Well, let me check. I was also surprised, I forgot that the siblings do like two hearts of damage if you touch them. Kill those enemies. Keep going. Can I do it? Nope. Still can't do it. You need like the the up the up spell attack. That's why I should probably look up how to get next. But let me try and make my way out of this place. And then I'll call it an episode. Unfortunately. Getting back out isn't so easy. And ouch. As you can see, put me all the way back down here. That was close. And that sibling is still like, ooh, that was close as well. That sibling is still around down there. I'm kind of hanging a little bit to the left because there is something on the left hand side wall though I don't think I can do it yet. All right. Is it here? Oh no. No, no, no! Ah! Why did I have to fall that way? Well, at least the game respawned me back here. No. Oh. No! Why did I do that? Hey, this enemy is kind of in the way. Get out of the way. Oh, there it is. That's why I was talking about, but I can't reach it. Of course. I have to go to the right first. Gotta go to the right to get to the left. But I'm pretty sure I can't do it because you need to have uh, lifeblood hearts. And actually you have to have a certain amount of lifeblood hearts. So I'm just gonna ignore it actually. Okay. And I still have not sat at a bench yet so my map is not updated. I'm getting close to the top again. Oh, hey, it's Hornet. Ghost, I see you faced the place of your birth and now drape yourself in the substance of its shadow. Though our strength is born of similar source, that part of you, that crucial emptiness, I do not share. Funny, then, that such darkness gives me hope. Within it, 
I see the chance of change. A difficult journey you would face, but a choice it can create. Prolong our world's stasis or face the heart of its infection. Yeah. I'd urge you to take the harder path, but what end may come? The decision rests to you, uh, on you. Yeah, so basically she's talking about taking on the Radiance. Um, the Radiance is essentially like I've already explained a few times. It's the the infection, the source of the infection in this world. And it's like a godlike being. And it's what's causing all this orange goop stuff to infect everyone and everything. I'm going to get to a... I'm gonna get back to a bench. Well, there's one to the left. I don't know why I'm going this way. I guess it's just because this leads to a stag station. So, as I was talking about, I do want to eventually go back to Salubra, and I eventually want to um, do a... Like, hold on. Let me bring up my map, just so I can... Talk, like be more clear about what I'm talking about here. I want to go to Salubra and see if I can get more charm notches if I can afford it. And then also I need to go over to the Fungal Waste to see the Leg Eater. There's also something down there near Mantis Village I can still do. Um, and then of course there's a Dreamer. And there's still quite a few pathways you can see I haven't gone on yet. Like a bunch of pathways to the left there. And actually that leads to a new area from the green path. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just um, take the stag station over here to the forgotten, or should I say infected crossroads. And we'll go and see Salubra and then, I don't know, I might make my way over to Leg Eater and then stop. Oh, that's right. I don't... I think I can. Hold on. I might be able to. Let me just take the stag station there. Okay, to not the city storerooms. Where is it? Um, Forgotten Crossroads. There we go. Okay. Oh, so I have been playing a lot of the new Zelda game, Tears of the Kingdom. I do have a few complaints though, like, I'm having a hard time getting to the, like, the first major dungeon of the game. I went to, um, Hebra, because that's where I was able to go, and Hebra is like the snowy, mountainy area, and it's home of the, the Ritos, you know, the bird people, and... And I'm there, and I'm trying to get up into the, like the onto the, like the uh, sky island or whatever that I need to get to. <laughs> and I'm just having a hard time because it's weird. It's like there's a large like um how do I explain it? It's like a tower, but it's not really a tower because it's coming out of like the bottom of the uh it's coming out of the bottom wait why did i go here it's coming out of the bottom of uh giant sky island and i, I can climb up it but then there's just like a lip that i can't get uh, i can't get around and i'm having a hard time figuring out what to do and even though i have this power up this ability that lets me like go through <laughs> things that i'm underneath I have to be like close enough to it for it to work and yeah 18 charms oh my god salubra 25 ah <sighs> salubra you're killing me here but if I buy these I won't be able to afford the thing from leg eater <laughs> Fine, forget it. I came here for nothing. Let's just make our way to Leg Eater. And, oh. Yeah. Watch out for exploding eyes. Thankfully, I can bypass them by going this way. Can I go that way? Let's see. Alright. No, no, run away from the GL. Oh, I didn't know you were here.
Ah, one of the last remaining leaping husks. All right, let's keep going. Oh, is this pathway blocked off? I hope it's not. Let me see something. What was here to the left again? There's another leaving husk right there. Have I not done this yet? What is all this? Nothing? Oh, I guess this just lead, led to a mask shard or something. Yeah, I think that just led to a mask shard. Alright, let's go. Let's go! <laughs> let's go down into the fungal waste, which is actually where I want to go. Wait. This isn't the fungal waste. Oh, no, no, wait, there is still a way down to the fungal waste. It's just not how I imagined it being. And I've cornered myself. Oh my gosh, I didn't even need to go down here. Okay, I'm wasting time. And fall down and go to the left. Okay. Alright. Ah, no, no, no. Gotta watch out for spikes. Alright. Now we can get to the forgotten. Or I mean fungal waste. Jeez. But where exactly does this put me at in the fungal ways? Does this put me at where I think it does? Puts me here. Okay, that's not too bad. Oh yeah, that's right. Now I can finally do this. I wasn't able to do this before earlier on in the playthrough because I didn't have the desolate dive. And now we can actually exit and leave the ooh, city of tears whenever I need to. And I almost ate it there. Alright, I gotta hurry. I gotta hurry and get back up to Leg Eater. Ow. Oh no, acid. Whatever shall I do? Okay. Oh yeah, I go to the right here and then I go up. I don't even really need to keep this in. I guess I could talk a little... Jeez. I guess I could talk a little bit more of uh, Tears of the Kingdom. The plot is very, 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 very much like the same as Breath of the Wild. And I find it to be a little bit disappointing. I wish they had gone with a little bit of a different, you know, a little bit more of a variety rather than just, you know, it really is Breath of the Wild too, because that's essentially what it is, is it's just Breath of the Wild. I, like, I don't know, that to me is a little bit disappointing. I mean, I do like it, I mean, I loved Breath of the Wild, I was super obsessed over it when it was first out, but... I'm just kind of like, I was hoping to see something a little bit more new, you know? It's okay though, it's still a great game, it's still great A, and it gives you so much to explore, it's like Breath of the Wild plus, <laughs> Breath of the Wild plus extra. Alright, let's sit here, and let's see. Yeah, you broke it. I gave you that charm as a gift, and you broke it. Clumsy little fool. Nasty. Apologize. Ask me nicely, and I'll fix it for you. Give me Geo, and I'll fix it for you. Oh my god, 600. Oh wait, that's for uh, fragile strength. 
Um, yeah, repair fragile greed. It's gonna be worth it. And oh, might as well get fragile heart as well. That's actually pretty useful. Fragile strength would be really useful, but I can't afford it. All right. Well, in the next episode, I will actually make my way over to the left here to where that dreamer is at, and see if I can get the next dreamer. Um, see you guys then. Bye.